Hey, what's up guys? I'm Barracks. Welcome back to Star Citizen. Now, I remember last video, I said I was going to show you guys uh, some uh, Arena Commander and stuff like that, but I totally forgot and just remembered that um, I had a few people ask me that they wanted to see how to get to Grim Hex. So, I'm going to show you guys today how to get to Grim Hex, and I'm going to show you also how to clear your name at SPK or Spaceport Korea, aka Spaceport Korea. Also, uh, either next video or the video after that, I'm going to show you guys some uh, ships that I got in case you're interested in seeing them or anything like that, uh, or you want to purchase them. I bought an Orion, uh, as well as a retaliator and some other stuff uh, as well as the new concept ship uh, the hawk I did not buy the hammerhead um, I just didn't really see a use for it uh, for anything I was really gonna be doing so I kinda skipped out on that but it does look like a cool ship but I do have some stuff and I will show you guys that stuff in case you're ever interested in getting it and then also you know as my merchant man gets implemented and the Orion and you know all this other ships that I have that uh, um, aren't quite here yet um, I will definitely give you guys a tour of those just so you can see and you know decide if it's uh, something you want for yourself or you know how uh, you know whatever you guys want to do with it so um, uh, we're gonna go to Grim Hex really quick um, I'm gonna take um, I'm just gonna take my Hornet you know I'll, I'll, I'll save some of my other ships for uh, for uh, you know um, Showing you guys, uh, you know, the um, those ships. You know, I'll, I'll save them for the other video. I won't let you. Uh, I won't spoil the surprises or anything like that. But I'll show you guys some of that. So, anyways, um, I'm gonna pop into my ship here after we get through this. Um, and you know, uh, when um. After I show you guys this, like I said, I'm going to show you how to clear your name in SPK. Now, SPK uh, sometimes is uh, kind of heavily PvP'd, and, um, you know, we might have to, you know, uh, get in some conflict. But, I'll, I mean, I my name's clear right now. I don't really have to do anything, but I'm going to go ahead and just uh, show you how to, how to do it. Um, but, uh, basically... Uh, as far as, uh, you know, getting to Grim Hex, uh, you know, in case you want to do some shopping over there or, you know, whatever, um, I'll give you guys a, uh, I'll give you guys um, a little example how to get there. So one thing, you know, when you get into the game, you know, you might be like, well, you know, how do you jump around to places or, you know, whatever. All you do is hit B on your keyboard and then you'll have like the whole select destination thing and then you'll see, you know, all the areas that you can jump to. Now the area that you want to go to is you want to find uh, Yella, Yela, however you want to pronounce it. Um, in English, that would say Yella, but I mean, you never know. I mean, it, it could be Yela as well. Uh, so, who knows? Um, I've never uh, listened to any of the dev team or anything pronounce that, so I'm not sure. But we'll just call it Yella for right now. Um, but anyways, so what you want to do is you want to target that, and then you want to hit F to, you know, spool your quantum drive up and quantum jump to it. Now when you get here, <clears throat> um, you're going to have to go a little bit offset and kind of jump to nothing. Now there's a ship right there. So what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to hit B, and then you're going to just want to jump a bit to the right of it okay and then just hit F and when you hit F as soon as you go in hit F again and it'll take you out it takes a second to kinda spool down so to speak and, and drop you out but you'll drop out hit B again and target Yela and uh, just go right on into it now when you come out here on this side of it um, Grim Hex normally uh, should be uh, on the right hand side. You'll see, uh, so we got here, 
and it'll be like I believe that's it right there so this this big pile of rocks you can kind of see like a very if you look very closely it's like you can see the beams and stuff like that uh, kind of like a structure thing uh, attaching asteroid to asteroid type thing so right here is uh, Grim Hex um, it is a little tricky kind of finding the landing pad and getting into but it's really not that hard um, like I said it's uh, really quick to be able to get here like I said you just um, fly from Port Alisar to um, Yella and then you know fly offset to the right uh, past it and then you know turn back around and and just hit it again so when you come into here you're gonna you know see this place that is uh, sparking and all crazy and what you're gonna want to do is um, I'm, I might have to get in a dog fight because I see somebody on my radar and he is wanted Uh, don't don't do it, sir. It uh, it'll it'll be a bad day for you. All right. So, anyways, so here, um, what we're gonna do is um, I always lose the entrance here. Um, and you might see these. Uh, it's kind of like the buildings and stuff, but it's it's uh not quite the entrance. Um, it's just part of the structure of the internal I guess spaceport you can say but uh, we're gonna fly through here and try not to hit anything and blow up that would be uh, that'd be a bad bad case of stuff and right here so just like almost right on the other side so all you're gonna do is you're gonna pull up to here you're gonna hit N which is gonna lower your landing gear and then you're gonna see like the little white dot type of thing and it's gonna say like hey you can land here so we're just gonna uh, go down here a little bit more and then I'm lazy so I'm just gonna uh, you can also kinda auto land uh, when you get over your pad and you're kinda within that white line you can hold N and then it'll do this and just kinda auto land you uh, so when you get here, it is PvP, like I said uh, in my Grim Hex video, until you get in the airlock. But I'll show you guys how to get there really quick. Um, just so, you know, you can, um, when you get here, I'm not leaving you high and dry, and then you're like running around outside trying to figure out where to go and stuff. But we'll, we'll bust out the gun, uh, not the shoddy. There we go. Um, so when you get here you can just go up these steps and you'll see like right here it says the airlock one and two um, this is a um, this is the other airlock I seen like a shadow I thought it was like a person or something it might have been it might not have been I don't I'm not really 100% sure but anyways you can just run up here and just keep going and then just like jump into the airlock and it's right there it'll t it'll take you all the way down uh, to the fl you know uh, to the floor and stuff like that where you can spawn your ship and then you know um, you can also uh, take kind of like an elevator down so to speak uh, to you know get onto the main floor or go shopping and do that so I just want to show you guys that really quick okay guys we are back uh, in my ship and um, so here we go so we're gonna take off we're gonna hit uh, the B button to select the destination and uh, we're gonna spin around here now what you want to look for is SPK which is right here um, or not spaceport sorry security post Korea I don't know why I keep saying spaceport Korea but I mean you know whatever same thing um, but yeah um, so SPK uh, if anybody if you ever hear those those um, you know uh, those abbreviations uh, it just means security port Korea so to go there all you do is just jump you can also see it from Port Alisar you know anywhere here and you're just gonna jump there and then after you jump there 
you're going to basically kind of um, find a spot to land. Uh, there's a couple of pads there. Um, if you're not really good with FPS or, you, you know, you don't want to, you know, get in any FPS fights, you don't want to deal with anything or whatever, um, you know, you can always check. I mean, usually um, there's nobody here, usually. I have came here a couple of times and found out that just because there's no ships outside doesn't mean, you know, somebody's not here. Um, that actually happened to me yesterday, to be honest. We were here, there was no ships here, and we went inside, and I ended up uh, killing somebody that started shooting at me. Now, I was kind of nice. I gave them the benefit of the doubt. Uh, I didn't fire first, and I sat there and stared at him for a minute, and then he just started shooting at me, so I killed him. Um, <laughs> so, I mean, I was, I was trying to be, you know, I was trying to be nice. But stuff like that uh, can happen, so just don't think that, you know, just because there's no ships here, nobody can be here. Um, but yeah, uh, you basically just land on one of the pads, come in here, go into the airlock. Uh, this place is kind of big, and it is all full-on PvP. Uh, it will not lock your weapons when you get in here, like uh, any spaceports or anything. So when you enter here, you know, if you want to clear this area and stuff like that, you can. But basically, you want this room right here. Like, almost as soon as you run in, you want to come up here, and you want to use this computer. And as soon as it starts doing that, okay, it's going to kind of be like a PvP hold point. As long as that's going on and, like, you know, clearing your name and doing stuff like that, um, you know, you have to kind of guard it. Because uh, somebody can just come and stop it and stuff. Uh, you know, so, I mean, that's it. And you can also come through here, too. Uh, there's, like, uh, there's, like, lockers, uh, all around the, uh, outsides and stuff like that, that, uh, you know, you can open. And if, uh, you know, if you open them, there's usually bourbon or something like right there. Uh, you can pick it up for some, like, extra cash. Um, also, on the top floor, I'll show you guys this really quick, because this place is a bit more than to just clear your name. Uh, you can come over here, you can refill your grenades, refill your ammo, um, and then across over here, uh, I believe it's the medical bay, so you can come over here, grab your, uh, you know, your medipens and stuff like that, and uh, across over here, I believe they have, and you know, here's some more lockers too. Like I said, I mean, you, you'll, you'll, you'll have a bunch of lockers and stuff like that, like here, right here, like this. You could just pick that up, and then, you know get the, get get some money for that stuff and uh and across over here uh they have you know weapons all over so here's uh here's a sniper rifle uh they got a shotgun uh ballistic rifle so i mean you know they have some you know boxes of that stuff and then up here um you know you got your uh top airlock and uh some stuff like that there's nothing really up here, uh, just some extra lockers and stuff like that. Um, you know, little, I don't know, I guess offices, I guess you can say. Some data pads and stuff, but that's about it. And um, that's pretty much it. So, um, if you guys have any questions, comments, or concerns, you know, feel free to leave them. Uh, I figured uh, I would try to help you guys out a little bit. Uh, you know, like I said, I'm also a new player, and uh, I'm just trying to make videos over things that, uh, you know, I would kind of want to see before either purchasing the game or, you know, uh, things like when you get into the game and you're kind of new, you know, that you, you know, you might want to know the answer to or, you know, you might, you know, have thought about and you're like, well, I'm curious, like, how to do that or how to get there or, like, even some of this stuff. I didn't know about and I had to have like you know multiple org members and other people tell me about them you know otherwise I would have you know really never knew so I hope I'm helping some of you guys I hope I'm you know you know kind of you know doing some stuff for you guys and you know doing other stuff and trying to help you guys out and stuff but um, you know, for the most part, guys. I mean, I, I hope you're I hope you're enjoying my um, little uh, tutorials and different things like that. 
Oh, one thing I want to tell you guys too. Okay, so anything that's orange, okay, it's obstructed and you can't jump to it. So if you want to get to Port Alisar, you kind of have to jump around Crusader. So if you pick something offset of something, usually it'll take you kind of a bit past it or, you know, right next to it. So it won't be LOS or AKA line of sight. Um, and then you can just basically hit B again, turn right back around and then just, you know, go boom right back to Port Alisar or you know whatever you want to do so I figured um, I would let you guys know that as well really quick uh, but like I said I mean that's it for the most part and uh, that's it and I mean like I said before just to land you just go up to any D A B C whatever pad you want it doesn't matter uh, and then you just hit N you'll get a kind of a different HUD for you know for landing and uh, it'll uh, give you a little directional uh, arrow a set of red directional arrows and then you can just uh, kind of go here um, if you want to just regularly land then you know you can just hit your left control and just set it down and that's it if not I mean and you you know you don't want to do that you can just hold end and end will uh, holding end will I mean you can hold it and then as soon as it the animation start taking over to land your ship or auto land or autopilot land or whatever uh, you can just release it but then it'll just do that and then land and that's it so um that's pretty much it guys uh you know thanks for watching i appreciate the uh love and support uh hope this helps some of you guys out and uh you know if there's uh anything that you guys you know would like me to cover or uh you know you have any questions about or you know that you want to see or something you know feel free to ask i have no problem uh you know making uh, a video for you guys keeping you guys well informed and trying to help you guys um you know make an informed decision over either, either buying the game or a ship or you know if you have the game uh you know just how to you know do certain things in it or whatever but yeah sure um uh just leave a comment and uh, i'll hook you up but anyways guys uh thanks for watching i appreciate it uh much love all and i will see you guys in the next one Take care, all. Later.